I meant to talk about this in yesterday's upload, but we've got some news today, so be prepared for some drops. Now, none of this is confirmed, but there are some psychos out there that like to dive into the different files that is provided in Modern Warfare. You see, a lot of times developers, what they'll do is in order to keep the updates lower in, in data, they haven't really done a good job with that, have they? <laughs> what they'll do is they'll sneak some items inside of the file so that way downloads are smaller. So these psychos who are insanely good at looking through all of these files, they're called data miners, have gotten a couple of guns leaked and potentially these are the weapons that are becoming up in season four. When does this battle pass even end? Pass resets in 16 days. So we've got about like half a month before this thing is, is going to be released. Now I can't show any of the pictures because Call of Duty will strike me down with their whole Holy power. However, we can still talk about it. what I'll do for you guys is I'll leave a link of a Reddit post that is going to be in the description. So that way you guys can check out these pictures. But it's looking like the Galil is going to be making a come back into modern warfare if you guys didn't know what that was that was a gun that was in black ops one and it's showed up a couple of times in different reiterations in the past call of duties we've also got a light submachine gun and i'm not too sure what this is this might be the apc9 but it's essentially a smaller submachine gun so they're looking like they're going to add an assault rifle and a submachine gun to this game for season four and goddamn, is that disappointing i just want a sniper man just give me one additional sniper and i'll definitely be happy Happy. There is an anti-material rifle that kind of looks like the Barrett that is inside of the files, but long story short, it's just a name and it doesn't even have most of the files that would usually go along with leaks that are more confirmed. They're probably just playing with the files and playing with the idea, which gives us hope, but eh, you should feel pretty doubtful about this. It's actually really hilarious if you think about it, like what is happening with these files, because they're not just coming in from data miners. There are people that are actually getting them in certain game modes. For example, the gun I mentioned earlier, the ABC9, somebody got it in gun game and their game didn't immediately crash. They were able to use it. So what that tells me is that this gun is in far development and that it's most likely going to be in season four or season five. Y'all know me, I'm a psycho with a sniper. So if I can get myself a fucking bear at 50 cal, I'd be so happy about that. I want to know your guys's biggest pet peeve in this game, because to be honest, if we had to go down the list of annoying things, I, I could write a whole 10 page essay on that shit. I'm already planning the outline in my head. You can still love something even though you're extremely annoyed with it. I think one of my main points would definitely be turtles, people that put ride shields on their back because they just completely debunk me. If I had to add anything else, it'd probably be the maps in this game. So yeah, comment down below what your biggest pet peeves are about this game. So I just want to share with you guys how much of an absolute dweeb that I am. Like, dude, I don't know how I have any friends. I am biggest nerd neck you've ever seen in your life. When I'm 52 years old, my spine is going to look like a pretzel. I'm going to be every chiropractor's absolute nightmare. After I leave their office, this doctor is going to come home to his wife and just cry. It was the worst I've ever seen. So a lot of people, what they'll do if they need motivation is they'll maybe watch a Gary Vee video. They'll hype themselves up, talk to to themselves say that they're the best around i know a guy that watches rocky maybe watches a little bit of wwe if you're gonna need some toxic masculinity in your life i uh watch old phase videos <laughs> now if you're a new call of duty player i understand you're not hip to the old phase montages i get it you just didn't play modern warfare 2 and it's prime and it's fine it's fine it's definitely okay but dude these these old montages especially when you're 13 years old you've got all of your hormones raging you watch a Phase ill cams video it just tickles your trousers that was bizarre <laughs> in all realness like i would get super inspired i would want to create content i would want to snipe on call of duty i would want to make montages and i visited a couple of those montages today and i gotta tell you face clan sniping with style 2 slaps brother i can't do any reactions because lord knows copyright on youtube is going to instantly slap me the moment that michael moore wing song comes on please just check it out for your own sake it was just so good i never knew that a song about a shoe would inspire me so damn much. So if you're wondering where I get my energy from, it's because I'm an absolute dweeb and look up gaming videos in order to be inspired.
I just don't understand. I just don't understand. Why Why do you sit there in one spot? Why? Why? Why do you expose yourself as one of the biggest betas I've ever met in my life? This kid definitely sits when he pees. This kid sits at the lunch table by himself and reads goosebumps at the age of 17. But he looks like E.T. with a ponytail, but he's balding. Every time he goes to homecoming, he tries to do the Dougie, but he looks like he's fucking wearing light up sketchers. Honestly, we need to bring toxicity back to gaming. I love- Brandon, it's toxic. It ruins the community. I'm not saying that we need to bully each other, but just know that like, if you're in a video game lobby, it's not that serious, bro. You need to calm down. Anyway, my most recent videos are going to be popping up on the screen now. Hope you guys are having a great day. It's been your boy Spin Shoot Impress. Please have a great rest of your day. And I'm out, guys. Peace.